Hey guys, Justin here of Yugatech, and over the past few years, we've seen a lot of smart TVs already. Generally, aside from simply being a medium to display images, smart TVs are their own independent devices. In terms of entertainment, they can do just as much as your phone or computer. But what if your smart TV could be more than just intelligent, but also sophisticated and elegant to complement your beautiful home? Well guys, what you're seeing now is Samsung's new lifestyle TV, the 65-inch The Frame 2020 model, and it's now officially available in the Philippines, including its stylish accessories that I'm excited to talk more about later on. Now, given that it's a smart QLED TV, it's also an incredible work of art on its own. What makes the frame stand out is its art mode, which smoothly transforms the TV into an elegant frame to showcase curated masterpieces right in your home. It's like your own personal art gallery. On top of that, the Samsung TV has its own art store. The art store is a unique platform to have access to thousands of artworks from 38 galleries across the globe if you sign up as a full member. Now that's really something. You can also upload your own portraits or masterpieces to exhibit by the way. So yes, it's a TV when it's on and art when it's off. How cool is that? Moreover, it has an ambient mode that detects ambient light then automatically balances the screen's brightness and color tone to keep your art looking natural. It also has a motion sensor function that detects motions and automatically turns art mode on and off depending on human presence. This will help save energy. So now let's talk about its sleek and minimalist design that can easily blend in any wall or space. With just the right size for a smart QLED TV, Samsung's The Frame looks seamless without noticeable cables hanging around and it has a no-gap wall mount to make it appear like a real frame. Speaking of frame, it's overall the frame bezel isn't just thin but it's also customizable so you can style it to match your home interior with its premium look. The frame's customizable bezels are easily attachable and interchangeable magnetic bezels in four color options available. There's beige, white, brown, and black. Samsung also offers a studio stand so you can easily place the frame anywhere you like. So besides the tasteful design, its quality surely doesn't disappoint either. It's got a 4K QLED display with HDR10 Plus for a vibrant and true-to-life experience. It also has an active voice amplifier feature that senses surrounding sound in real time to adjust the volume and clarity. So even through the noise around you, you can still clearly hear what you're watching. To control the frame, you can use the included One Remote Control or you can download Samsung's SmartThings app if you'd rather use your phone. You can also use the Smart Hub on screen to easily search for movies, TV shows, or browse the web. As for other smart TV features, you can enjoy mobile mirroring, tap view, and multi-view that allows you to stream shows via both the frame and your smartphone at the same time. And of course, this being a Samsung TV, it's backed by Bixby for voice commands like searching or changing the channel. So Samsung's The Frame surely isn't your typical smart TV. At the same time, it's also not just aesthetics for your home. It's both these things at the same time. You get a stunning display and easy access to world-class masterpieces right in the comfort of your own space. Now, if you want an even more immersive experience with it, then we recommend that you pair it with Samsung Soundbar Q900T for an all-out home theater vibe. And that's it for now, guys. Don't forget to let us know what you think about Samsung's The Frame 2020 and Samsung Soundbar Q900T in the comments. And like usual, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to our channel for more content, hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads, and be sure to visit yugatech.com for the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this is Justin, and don't forget to wash your hands and stay at home.